Hello, I'm Eldon and welcome to today's episode of Video News. Frying French fries in space may be possible, according to a recent study by Aristotle University of Thessaloniki, Greece. On Earth, we have gravity and buoyancy. Gravity makes sure that the oil stays in the cooker and buoyancy allows the bubbles that come out of the fries to travel upwards so that the fries are cooked. In space, which is under microgravity, there is no buoyancy. So scientists for long believed that frying wasn't possible. The research team first designed a sealed container that could fry the potato safely in zero gravity. European Space Agency, or ESA, then took the researchers on a ride. The plane climbed up and then at a certain point headed down just like a roller coaster. There were about 20 seconds of microgravity when the plane reached the highest point, during which the team did tests. To their surprise, the fries were cooked and the bubbles were able to escape. This was because when being fried, the water inside the potato turned into vapour. The vapour created pressure when released from the potato. The pressure inside the potato allowed the bubbles to go out and let the oil come in, according to the research paper. It showed that frying can occur in space. This isn't the first attempt for scientists to deep fry french fries in space. Early in 2014, with the help of ESA, a group of researchers conducted studies under various gravities. The agency's large centrifuge can create artificial gravity from 1 to 20 g, with g referring to the gravitational acceleration at the surface of the Earth. It has four arms and can spin fast. During the spin, things held by the arm are under centrifugal force, which is the source of artificial gravity. The fries were cooked under different gravities from 1 to 9 g. They discovered that the French fries had the most crispy crust under 3G. It's interesting to mention that Jupiter's gravity is 2.4 times that of the Earth's gravity. So French fries may have the perfect taste if cooked on Jupiter, compared with other planets in the solar system. That's all for today's VDO news. See you next time.